Morning, beautiful people. I am currently in Tundikal, Kathmandu. Happy Loser! Tamu Loser is actually a New Year marking for Gurung's ethnicity. Gurung is one of the indigenous inhabitants in Nepal that is mostly based in west and central of Nepal. Today I am with. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. So he is kind enough to invite me to enjoy and celebrate today's festival. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> also, <Hi>. hello. <laughs> this is brother. Dear hey. brother. How do you say your name? Pratap. Pratap. Do you know how long this celebration will take? Oh, actually, yeah, it takes a whole day. It takes Until a whole in day. Until the evening, yeah. Oh, it's nice. Going to close around in nine, ten o'clock. This is the our groom special New Year time. Okay. What do you do usually um, during actually, this celebration? Actually, we just singing, dancing, and. Ah. And yeah, family <laughs> gathering together. Yeah. Other than that, people are dressing up. Let me show. <laughs> so they are dressing up. It's beautiful. You see, the dress is maroon with beautiful necklace, the green one. What's your name? Sorry, she's a name. so pretty. <laughs> How do you say Happy New Year? Happy Loser? Is that right? Yeah. Yes, Happy Loser. fascinating to witness all the parade because they are just starting to walk all the way from the close to Durbar Square all the way to the road and then they're all walking together wearing traditional outfits playing traditional music
was told that all of these are Gurum community, Gurum ethnicity inhabitants that came all the way to Kathmandu, coming from different parts of um, Nepal, probably the other side of Kathmandu or outside of Kathmandu, I don't really know, but it is so beautiful to see and it's so fascinating to see they're all come together, wear beautiful traditional dresses, clothing, and how everyone are dancing, also playing the music with so much pride. So fascinating for me to see. I'm very, very grateful to be able to witness myself. Today, it was the year of a dog, whereas today, marking from today, the Gurung is celebrating the year of a deer. That's why you see a lot of people holding like cardboard or even a, a huge banner of telling um, a new year and hearing the year of a deer. How do you feel? I feel so exciting. exciting. <laughs> so, if you are interested in visiting Nepal and experience the festival yourself, usually it happens in what, December, yeah? So usually the New Year of Guru happens between December and January because each ethnicity they have their own calendar. Yes? Yeah. Yep. We have the one calendar. Now New Year is in English year, Christmas and English New Year. Between the between, between those time. Yeah, so it have it falls between around December or January, depending on their their own calendar. This is it's it's just so fascinating. I keep saying fascinating. So I'm currently in one of the parades because uh, Nir, a friend of mine, he is also grown part of the girl and this is part of it, his family sort of like cousins, sister in laws and everything. So much joy, so much happiness, it, it's so contagious. <laughs> We are currently at Tundikau, so we are back at Tundikau. It is bright under the sun. Prime Minister is still giving the speech, and people are preparing to perform because every single group will perform different songs, different dancing. So I'm waiting for that to happen. There is just so many people with beautiful, beautiful traditional outfits. It's been such a lovely day, however, um, I'm feeling quite unwell. So I'm thinking 
instead of um, pushing myself then to see what's going on because there are too many people it's festival it's lovely but I think what is going to happen all of them are going to dance um, differently according to the community and everything like that however we've seen quite enough of dancing um, different costumes and traditions and I think I'll just say goodbye right now thank you so much for watching <laughs> see you next time bye that cam that cam that uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. different cell <laughs>